All right. After all the dead adder uh, videos, we finally have an LA pit that looks like an LA pit. This is an Aspidalops lubricus lubricus. Uh, I believe it's Cape Coral Cobra. It's not a true cobra. Its venom is nowhere as strong as a Naya species. Uh, what a beautiful fossorial snake, nevertheless. Um, let's try to feed it and see what happens. This is also a new addition. There you go. Again, that pinky might be a little too big for this boy also. But let's see what happens. Now let me give you a little information about these snakes. As I said before, uh, these are fossorial snakes. They are borrowers. They live on uh, desert parts of South Africa and they burrow underground using their um, tail and nose scale which is like a shield. There is only uh, one documented case of fatality with uh, this species, not the exact subspecies but another subspecies of um, I think a couple young girls they got bitten while they were sleeping by a very large individual and they got killed unfortunately but the venom is seen as medically significant but not very dangerous to healthy adults I don't think they can kill a healthy adult human being of course you'll probably have a bad day if you get bitten um, These are very uh, calm snakes. They occasionally hood like a cobra, uh, but uh, as I told you, they are not true cobras. And um, it's probably just an adaptation to again to make yourself look bigger now. He stopped trying to eat the pinky. He will retry. But again, this might be a um, too large of a pinky for him to swallow, and he's definitely trying it the wrong way. The only thing that he can do is go from the nose. But he's trying, so let's give him that. Um, I'll be able to go to a reptile show this weekend <clears throat> and um, get a wide variety of prey items more suitable for the baby that adders and, <clears throat> and for him. I still think he can um, eat that. Let's see what happens. Uh, for now I'll stop the video and get back to it when he has a better idea how to solve this pinky. Okay, here is a quick return to the hospital up speeding. Um, he's on the right track. He got the head in and I think after this point it's gonna be a um, fast feeding. This is a yearling snake and I would assume that it would be able to feed on larger pinkies but apparently he cannot do it comfortably so again I'll get smaller ones for him as well unfortunately um, he ended up turning his back to us so we cannot see much of the feeding 
but we can see his pretty colors at least um, again he's doing a good job he's um, done with the first part of the body got the limbs in pretty much so he'll manage uh, just a quick tip to uh, people who keep who wants to keep a up species um, even though they are fossorial snake species and they're ground dwelling and burrowing for some reason uh, smell of birds like chicken blood is a good way to start these guys to feed so when you have um, hatchlings that they don't eat you can get a, uh, a little blood of a chicken or maybe even egg and they will if you uh, just dip the head of a day old pinky or something in that they'll start feeding right away okay um, he's going out of focus so we are just gonna stop here but I'll have uh, much more footage about this guy also take care bye